here tonight. The following contest is an extreme rules match. Making his way to the ring, representing the New Day from Tampa, Florida. Weighing in at 285 pounds, Big E. Big E doesn't care how bad you think you are. He'll take on anyone. Bringing his smash mouth style to the ring, Big E will crush your own dreams before your very eyes. The Beast is here. Time for a beatdown, cowboy style. And his opponent, from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 295 pounds, Brock Lesnar. Brock Lesnar's been a dominant force his entire career. Yeah! And Brock's double-digit world title reigns should be all the proof you need. Brock Lesnar began his career dominating WWE, was nearly unstoppable in MMA, and has spent over a decade dominating the WWE landscape since returning. A man who has been virtually unstoppable. There you go. There's no telling what a competitor is capable of when they're battling under extreme rules. Oh, make no mistake about it. This match is high stakes, high risk, and high reward. A mistake here can take years off your career. And it's impossible to predict what kind of danger awaits because everything and anything is legal here, gentlemen. But did you guys just see the distance traveled on that toss? Quick thinking pays off. Placing them into the corner. And he has free reign to the outside with no count outs to worry about. What are they going to do with that ladder? The WWE Universe hey. starting to feel the power with Big E right about now. Big E able to avoid impact. Launched with a belly to belly. And back elbow creates separation. And he has an answer for Big E. Provides an escape. Punch. Looking for a high risk, high reward situation. From the top. Are you kidding me? What a shot. And in this kind of match, is it better to get out to an early lead or keep things even for as long as you can? There's certainly arguments for both, but if you find yourself in a position where you can run up the score, from where I'm sitting, you should, by all means, take it. Nice counter from Big E. Tossing their opponent. Cover! And a shoulder in the air. Starting to see the tolls of this match add up. Keeping them in position. Here it comes. Shoulder tackle. He's taking some good hits. Tossed around like a rag doll. It might not be flashy, but sometimes you just gotta toss another person to make a statement. He reverses it. What's coming next? Taking their time. Oh, God. Took the wind right out of you. And this might not have a present ending. The fight could get very dangerous out of ringside now. He's out. 
inside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. Oh. Right to the kidneys from behind. frame behind that move. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. His shoulders are down. And he has the shoulder up before two. It'll take more than that to hold him down. With the reversal. Shot right to the gut. Heads out and he has all the time he wants. Taking this outside. This could be good. Belly to belly. Uh-oh. Biggie on the receiving end. Saw it coming here, burst into the arm drag. Well, Brock way lays it. Burying knees into the body. Grabbing a hold of the arm. All the weight down. Hard to grab or apply a proper hold after a move like that. There's nothing off limits? Nope. Run out of ringside and back to the mat. He's taking this to the floor now. And he goes into the ring. Belly to belly. Vicious. And shoulders are down. Still in it. and around and down. That's just hard to watch. Belly to belly suplex. For the win. Oh, oh. His intent to keep this monster down. Surprised to not even get a two count at this point. Oh, caught that foot by surprise. Oh, what a right hook. The submission is in. He could be up. He is doing whatever he can to break the car. And he does. Oh, God. You can't take much more of this. He can really stand to give back as good as he's getting right about now. This is when Big E really needs to hear that New Day Rock chant and get those massive hip flexors moving. Okay, Byron, leave the table. Go start your chant. I will. Quite enough to put him away. Tensions really running high now. 
Uh, yeah, we should probably clear the way, guys. Uh-oh, he's searching for something. Oh, no, a sledgehammer. Better call the paramedics right now. Oh, the sledgehammer connects. I don't scramble your insides.